again how TAPS honor our veterans after years of silence. It's every time I hear it, it brings tears to my eyes. New at six, after 10 years of silence, music returns to Fort Gibson Cemetery. and Veterans and neighbors say they've waited a long time for it. Do work she reporter Megan Allison meets those who are looking forward to hearing taps once again. It's the sound Fort Gibson has been waiting for. Bells ringing after 10 years of a silent cemetery. We couldn't do any timing. Everything had to be done manually and, and it was a, a nightmare trying to get it to work properly. The group American veterans paid for the repair. It took a decade to raise the $10,000 needed. A lot of people, a lot of local communities would even set their watch by the bell towers when it, when it was working. So I've had a lot of people that have asked about being able to get it back up. For veterans visiting the cemetery, this moment goes beyond just hearing the music again. That's an emotional 24 notes. Um, you know, you've, you've heard that um, all the time that you were in the service, and uh, quite honestly, I, I can't hear taps without, uh, without my eyes well enough. For others that walk through Fort Gibson, Hearing taps again hits even closer to home. Lieutenant Joey Cookson lost his son Cody in Afghanistan three years ago. One year later, the house across the street was on the market, allowing Cookson a view of his gravesite and now music to remember him by. I'm excited now, but once it happens, we'll just see. I mean, I know I'm gonna enjoy it, but I'm sure it's gonna be very emotional too. Reporting in Fort Gibson, Megan Allison. Two works for you.